Hey guys, it's me, Ja John, witness to Jesus Christ, servant to Jehovah and Leo. Um, posted another video. Haven't posted one in a while. I posted one up and uh, they struck it down according to their vaccine protocol uh, on YouTube. So they're censoring uh, people from speaking about vaccines, etc. But I just like to go on with this uh, coronavirus and uh, the race towards the new world order, which is what we're looking at today. Uh, it seems to be a, they keep putting in the media that they think that they're going to vaccinate 300 million people or the whole population um, of the United States within this year. But uh, many people don't like vaccines and don't want to be vaccinated. So it seems to me that they've made up in their minds that they can put it upon everyone and mandate it. And at, at first it seems like they're going to go, you know, they're pushing it, but it's going to get to a point where they're going to say, you know, we have so many people vaccinated a hundred million now. So now all the rest of you are going to have to get, because now you're a risk to us. And uh, we're developing this herd immunity thing. But if their vaccine works so good, and then why would they be worried about other people reinfecting them? <laughs> it makes no sense, right? And um, we see a struggle here, and the struggle between light and dark, between what is John natural, the natural way, you know, the natural world versus the science and artificial world. And uh, unfortunately, they make up, it seems they're making up a lot of numbers and they have to overhype things to uh, push whatever their agenda is. Um, and there certainly are a lot of questions as to what's in these vaccines and the companies that are producing them and, you know, what they're really up to. And I think that's fair. And, um, you know, YouTube and no other media should censor people from questioning or asking or even dissenting uh, their opinions about whether they think that it's a good thing or a bad thing. Um, that's what democracy is. So, at any rate, um, for me, you know, I am Jaw Witness and I understand what's going on here. And it's the battle, you know, light and dark, yin and yang, good and evil, whatever you want to call it. You know, and the, you see it going on in the world today, but everything is going to go back to God and he will judge everything. And people that think they can put these mandate, their science and their, you know, their medicine and their, all their whatever it is. And many people are already aware because I hear people online telling me all kinds of things about this uh, vaccine and what's really going on with it. And uh, it, I think it's people better be on their toes and uh, Christians certainly. And, uh, you know, we're warned about the mark of the beast and the devil trying to mark us. And um, certainly these vaccines, they want to put their stamp on us somehow. And they're calling the like, herd immunity is re referring to us as cattle, you know, and we're not cattle, we're people. Okay. And we have rights. We have right to express the government is supposed to represent us not mandate to us what they want, which is what is going on here. And it's very subversive. So you have to be aware because there are other forces involved and entities. And uh, like I said, you know, you have the John natural versus the artificial, you know, the way of Satan, you know. And um, so be on your toes, people, and protect the crown that Jesus Christ has for you of everlasting life. For those that are willing to stand up for what is right and true and to speak the word and, and know about the everlasting realm so they can't put these fear and use their fear to control us and do things that we don't want and that are not in our interest. Okay, so that being said, I'm going to post this. I wanted to make it quick. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. To Jesus Christ. And uh, let's all pray that he give us the strength to make it through this together, okay? Talk to you soon.